What's up guys, welcome back to What's Inside. Today we're gonna do something really interesting. You remember a few months ago we cut open the rose gold MacBook? Rose gold MacBook, is that what it was? Yeah, rose gold MacBook. We did that with our friend Jonathan Morrison from TLD Today. We decided to come here to California, get the new MacBook Pro. Rather than just cut the screen, which we did that last time, we're gonna drop it out of a helicopter and see if it can survive that. I think the helicopter test is gonna be a great way to see what's inside of it because I imagine it's going to shatter into a million beautiful pieces. But before we do that, Jonathan did a full review of this the day that it came out. Yes, sir. Break it down simply for us, like what are the top differences between this and maybe the old MacBook Pro? Yeah, so it's a weird one. It's kind of in this weird space where there's good, there's bad. Like it's thinner, it's lighter, it's faster, new awesome color. Okay. The problem that's like kind of got people a little upset is they took away quite a bit of ports. All you have I are two Thunderbolt 3 ports and that's it. So this acts as USB-C in terms of the form factor, but between those two ports and a handphone jack, that's it. No SD Whoa. card slot, no MagSafe, no regular USB port. The good news with that is like it's a multifunctional port, so out of this Thunderbolt 3 port, you could charge, you can transfer, you could output to a display. So there's some weirdness, but there's also some good to it. Okay, so here's a question for you. How many dongles do you travel with? <laughs> uh, honestly, usually before I wouldn't travel with any, but now, unfortunately, I do still use an SD card slot quite a bit, so I'm gonna be dongle life for that one. I like the computer though, it's lighter. If you can get past the ports and if you can have an entire travel bag of dongles, you're set. I think the important thing is that we take it out to the desert and see if we can drop it from a helicopter and see what happens. We're out in this lake bed that's all dried up. It's hard, clay. I mean, it's, this stuff is hard. And then I'm thinking we take this GoPro, maybe stick it right there, the Hero 5. I just got this Hero 5 and I really don't want it to be dead. Lincoln, hold on to that. I can do the honors of chucking it out of the plane. You'd like to. Okay. Sound good? So, yeah. And I'm gonna stay down here on the ground. Very smart idea as a computer is falling from a thousand feet to be on the ground. But I gotta get you guys a shot, right? And so as soon as it hits, before the helicopter even comes back down and lands, I'm gonna run over, check it out, see what it looks like. York? Let's do it. We gotta beat that sun, it's coming down. All right, be safe up there, guys. and drop this 13 inch MacBook Pro. Go ahead and open the door. Oh my. There you go, just push it out past the skin. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, do it! Go! Yeah, no! Oh my. Made it. Yeah. Oh, I can't even see it, can you? I can see it, I'm watching it. Oh my goodness. Okay, that was like the hardest thing to film in my life. There's no way I had any type of shot of that falling, but I saw it exploding. Here's the target, right there. There's the target. Over there is where it is. I'm so out of shape. <laughs> it's so far away. Oh man, it might've survived. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, look at that laptop. <laughs> oh, it's like a teepee, look at that. Oh, it popped out right there. 
Oh, that looks so cool. Oh man, that actually looks super, super cool. Look at that. That looks so amazing. Here's the GoPro. Let's see if it still works. Come on, GoPro. Hero 5. It still says it's rolling. It's still rolling. Oh, the whole front of the camera broke off. And the back you can't even see. Oh yeah, there they come. You gotta check York out at I Fly Heli. He makes awesome, awesome Instagram pictures. There he is. Thousand foot drop test. Let's see what these guys think about it. Check out the dirt. That's all it did. That's the only damage it did. It fell off? Okay, yeah, the GoPro came off, but it still worked. I turned it off already. Oh. And we're set. It looks like it worked. But look at this, I haven't even touched the MacBook yet. It, it just, like that? that's how it landed. Oh no! No. Oh. <laughs> look at it. Look at it, it's like opened up right here. But this is how it landed. What is this? Touch it? Wait, wait, what is this little piece? Oh, that's the enter key. Oh, that's the YouTube play button key. <laughs> wow. You keep that. Immediately, everything is bent to shambles. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything like that? No. The hinge kind of got a little wonky. <laughs> yeah. Um, have we tried booting on? No, I haven't tried anything. I just left it there for you guys to see. No. DOA. Oh. DOA. Wait, 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 I see a green light. Wait, wait, the oh. camera. Wait, it's still recording. The camera's still recording. Did How you, do you get it did off? Did you turn the recorder on? Yeah. yeah. <sighs> can we plug it into a computer and make it... We can plug what? this into a display, hopefully. Okay, all right. That's the plan, next plan of action. We're gonna take this thing back to the studio, plug it into another monitor, see if we can get the footage because the green light with the camera is still on, even though we can't turn the display on, which makes sense at a thousand feet. But that would be sweet if we can get some footage. That was amazing. Yesterday we did that. We are back here at the studio. We haven't really even messed with this. I haven't even tried to close it because I just want it to stay the same. Look at all the dirt that's still on it. Is look how warped it is. Like you can see, it's not flat. Do you see that Lincoln? Look at that, look straight across. Oh, whoa, it curves in. I can't figure out which way it landed. It looks like it was spinning like this, Yeah. right? I bet it hit the part where it's so open. It what had to have hit, hit this way. You know, it's like a sandwich this way. Mm -hmm. So impact, that seems like it would bend it. You know, it had to bend yeah. at just the right angle to like <laughs> sandwich <laughs> this guy. Let us know in the comments, like what you guys think, like which way do you think it landed? Was it flat with the bottom? Was it on the side like this? Was it down like this? We said we want to hook it up to a monitor and see if it'll still work. So time to do that and see if we can get some footage off of this thing. Find out. We'll use one of the two ports on oh, this. I computer. heard a sound. I heard a beep. If <laughs> this thing works. Oh, Whoa. props Wait, to Wait, that's what? it, that's, that's it. it. Dan, that's it, the password. Dan the man. Now we gotta see if the keyboard even works, so the password was Dan. <laughs> you just got hacked, buddy. So clever. <laughs> okay, does the trackpad work? The trackpad still works! What? This thing is totally beat up, but it still works. Look at that. I'm amazed by this, like seriously. This is it, this is from the computer. And there's the stinking clip right there. That's when we turn the GoPro on, I think. Yup, GoPro's on. This part's not very stable. That is so funny, it's just spinning. Oh, it just stopped! Why does it stop right it, there? It looks like it's still up pretty high in the air though, doesn't it? Okay, big props to Apple. I don't think you were planning on making a laptop that's durable enough to fall from a thousand feet and onto. the speakers were, will still work. The speakers, the USB-C port, it you can full it fully functions. You just you just need another monitor. I'm kind of surprised right now. I mean, it took a nasty spill. We're in. Who <laughs> needs a <laughs> screwdriver? Oh, it's so beautiful. Still, it looks like it's in great condition. Battery, battery, battery. This, Fan, is, this is the battery, right? Logic board. So this is everything here. Now, if you remember on the 12-inch one, everything was much smaller. Mm -hmm. uh, so this is obviously a higher power machine, so it's not going to be as compact. So they got the trackpad underneath the battery. That's kind of interesting. Ah, uh, I feel so guilty destroying Apple products. Like every time we do these videos, I'm like, dang it. So. To make us feel a little bit better, we bought some extra Apple products and we're gonna give them away to you guys. 
We have two Apple Watches and a brand new 13 inch MacBook Pro. So the details on that are on my channel. Basically, subscribe here on What's Inside, which I assume most of you are. Then check out my video where I review the 13 inch MacBook Pro. Subscribe there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I had a lot of fun. Thanks for inviting me out to the crazy helicopter ride. <laughs> that was fun. The MacBook, I promise you. It's dead. Well, I will bet you a new MacBook Pro. How about that? Okay. This thing is totally beat up, but it still works. If it lives, you'll give me a new one? You uh, yeah, are you prepared to give me a new one? Uh, no. All right. No, not at all. Then let's just, just say, just for bragging rights. Yeah, yeah, sounds good. You know something? Mm. No soup for you!